Welcome to Motivation at Hand. To know is to know how. Make your foot the foot that counts. Trump and Kamala, what a toxic brew. Two paths diverge, yet both ring false the red and blue. He plays the showman, legal woes in tow. She lacks the charm to make her star glow. Once upon a time. In a land that prides itself on being the beacon of democracy. A grand puppet master orchestrates. Political spectacles that challenge the very essence of choice. This Machiavellian architect. Hidden behind the curtains of power. Set the stage for a performance that would leave even. The most astute observers questioning. These candidates are the representation of liberty? Act 1. The Manipulator's Gambit. Our story begins with. Donald Trump. Remains at the pinnacle of power. Stilled embroiled in a web of legal battles. He is the Republican candidate, campaigning to win on Tuesday, November 5, 2024. While 88 felony charges hang over his head like dark clouds. Nonetheless, the super PAC's maneuvers. Top-tier exploitation of systemic loopholes. He has managed to delay justice. Dancing just beyond the reach of accountability. This display of apparent invincibility served to both awe and dismay the populace. Act 2. The Gaslighter's Shuffle. In a twist that left the nation reeling. President Biden made an unexpected move. To step down. From the presidential campaign. On Sunday, July 21, 2024. Some three and a half months away from the election. As tensions built for Biden to quit. He again chose. A figure whose previous bid for leadership ended in such spectacular failure. That her appointment to vice president. Is the only reason she is now the Democratic presidential presumptive nominee. This abrupt end to the Biden campaign. And the elevation of a previously rejected candidate. Sets the stage for a roller coaster ride of shock and awe. Act 3. The Coercive Controller's Grip. With these pieces in place, the populace are caught in a double bind. The creation of a false division into two contrasting things that obscures other potential solutions or candidates. The authoritarian figure behind this scheme had effectively removed any middle ground, forcing a polarization that left no room for nuance or alternative options. Act 4. The Social Engineer's Web. As the puppet master's influence seeps through every channel of communication and algorithms, carefully tuned by this behavioral architect, amplified the voices of the extremes while drowning out discussions beyond their double bind situations. The tapestry of public opinion is reduced to a binary, a this or that option. Act 5. The operant conditioner's reward. In this carefully constructed environment, Engagement with the political process itself become the reward. Those who fervently supported either side are given platforms. While voices of dissent or calls for alternatives are systematically marginalized. The electorate find themselves running between two unpalatable options. The very act of choosing becoming a form of compliance with the system. Epilogue. The Svengali's triumph. As the election draws near, the true masterstroke of this behavioral architect becomes clear. Regardless of the outcome, the fundamental structures of power remains unchanged. The illusion of choice is serving its purpose to engage the populace in frantic debates, while the real levers of control remain firmly in the hands of unseen puppet masters. In this tale of the world's self-proclaimed greatest democracy, the citizens find themselves not at a crossroads choosing but at the convergence of two paths leading to the same destination. The behavioral architect has constructed a perfect illusion. A choice that is no choice at all. Leaving the cognitively aware. To grapple with the realization. That the participation in this grand charade might itself be the most elaborate form of manipulation. Democracy's veneer, now cracked and worn. As history's shadows rise, familiar, forlorn. The cogent few sea cycles old resume. While puppet masters craft our shared costume. Much appreciation to you for giving of your time with us at Motivation at Hand. To know is to know how.
We trust you will come back soon.